Hey guys, welcome back. Alright, so uh, today we're going to be continuing more on the ice path, and uh, yeah, what I've got ahead and done off screen is I've uh, put my Weavile in the PC and I've got out my Furret so we can use Strength. And um, what I've also done off screen is I've pushed all the boulders on this floor into all these holes. So now hopefully we can uh, go through this part uh, much more easily. Now, I think you go here, and then here, and then here, and then here. Ah, lovely. Great. That's brilliant. <laughs> Okay, so let's uh, continue further on. So, uh, yeah, we can use Rock Smash on this boulder. If you don't have Rock Smash, then you can go around the other side and do it. Or what? Oh, that's brilliant. Okay. Yeah, you can go around the other side and get this item, and never melt ice, which is uh, pretty good. So yeah, you can always go around the other side and get it from here without having to use Rock Smash. Right, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, this is a... Uh, wait a minute. If you come over here... Right, I know how to get this item. Alright, basically... It's right here. Oh no. Ah, damn it, I made a mistake. Okay. Uh, that's fine, just come back down here again. <laughs> uh... Ah. Use, use another repel, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, we're gonna try and get all the items in this uh, in this place. It's uh, so it's not here; it's here. There we are. Ah, oh, TM Avalanche. That's that's good. That's pretty good as well. I uh, could teach that to my for alligator, but my for alligator is actually quite fast. For a, is uh, faster than an average for alligator, I guess. <laughs> right now, to get this item, uh, use strength. If you can get it just in the right place. Right, get it there. Then come around, all the way around. And then get it here. There we are. So yeah, uh, that's pretty much uh, what we're going to do today. Hope you guys are having a good day. In fact, I've actually, I'm actually making some uh, plans for the uh, final gym in this game. In fact, uh, I've got two plans. A plan A and a plan B. The plan B is just to... Uh, use Jolteon and Infernape to destroy the Kingdra, or I could just use my, or I could just use some X items and stuff like that, so yeah, <laughs> whichever one will work. So let me see. Me or oh my, is that you Matt? Fancy meeting you here. To tell the truth, my sandals are frozen on the ice and I'm stuck here. In other words, my flip flops are quick frozen with the ground. Tee hee. Well it's no laughing matter, would you push my back? Of course. You really are kind. Thank you so much. Alright. So, uh... There we are. Ah. <laughs> Wait a minute. No, I'm just trying to get that, I that item just there. Ah, oh, come on. God's sake. <laughs> Wait a minute. Let me think. Oh. <laughs> Seriously, I'm just slip sliding away like crazy. Okay, um now what? Now what do we do? Did I, did I have it just then? <laughs> uh you know what? Let's just leave that item for now. I don't think it's that important. Uh, yeah, I don't think that item's that important. But anyway, we have arrived at Blackthorn City. Yep, I didn't get all the items though. <laughs> uh, God. Okay. So, I think in this house, um, in this house you can, uh, trade uh, a Dragonair for a Dodrio, which I think is a pretty bad deal, in my opinion. <laughs> which is pretty ironic, considering that I have a collaborative channel called the Dodrio. Um, yeah, if you come in here, here's the move deleter and the move shooter house. So uh, if we go inside, uh, right now, uh, this is 
yeah, basically the move relearner. Uh, he will, uh, if you, uh, if you give him a heart scale, then uh, you can uh, make a Pokemon relearn a move. Like, uh, I'm probably going to teach my Weavile Night Slash. And uh, this is the move Deleter, which you can forget moves like HMs and stuff like that. And this is uh, Grandma Wilma, I think, which can teach uh, Draco Meteor, the strongest dragon move. And this is um, basically the um, person who teaches uh, Blast Burn, Hydro Cannon, and Frenzy Plant to your starter. So yeah, the Blazing Fire type Pokemon, Charizard, Typhlosion, Blaziken, and Infernape, the Restless Water types, Blastoise, Relegated, Swampert, and Empoleon, and the Quiet Grass types, Venusaur, Meganium, Sceptile, and Torterra. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much uh, Blackthorn City then. Um, you know what? Yeah, of course. You know what? How about... Because uh, we don't have that much to do in Blackthorn City now, how about... We have uh, we battle a few gym trainers actually, uh, because we still have uh, six minutes from the recording. So uh, wait a minute, I'm just gonna switch. I did actually do a little bit of off-screen training actually. Uh, I got a few, quite a few, I got a few of my Pokemon up to level 40, like my Feraligatr. <laughs> so uh, how about we take on a little bit of the gym today, a little bit. Not all the trainers, but just a little bit. Yo, champ in the making. This gym has unstable footing. Keep your Pokemon in their proper bars. Now, Claire uses the mythical and sacred dragon types. You can't damage them very easily, but you know they're supposed to be weak against ice types. Yep, and they're supposed to be weak against dragon type moves as well. Which is why I've taught my Feraligator Dragon Claw off screen. Right, so basically, the, the gym is basically to, yeah, do the puzzles and stuff like that. Actually, no, it's not my first battle against dragons. I battled with a dragon, actually. <laughs> right. So this guy's a Dratini. And another Dratini. And a Seedra. Okay. Yep, that is too bad. Okay, so, uh, continuing further on. That little teleporting thing over there, just to the left of the screen, it'll take you back to the entrance of the gym. Won't be able to beat them. I just beat her. I, di I didn't break a sweat beating the other trainers, the teenies. <laughs> And a Dragonair. Alright. Ho oh, ho! Nice. Okay. Way to go. Yep, I one hit KO'd the Dragonair. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. In fact, I actually feel a lot more confident now that we can beat this. Um, right, let's battle one more trainer and then we'll call it a day. And then we can battle all the other trainers in the next episode. Now, oh, wait a minute. There we are. Right, one more trainer and we'll call it a day. Interested in strong Pokemon? <laughs> Well, uh, I know drag dragons are strong, but not as strong as my four alligator. Haha. <laughs> right, guys, so that is the end of today's episode, guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, next time, we're going to be taking on the final trainers of the gym, and of course, the gym leader herself. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye!